I'm super excited for this video. The guarantee of a name. Those are my girls right there. You guys ready for a game changer? It's Vanilla Ice. Are you kidding me? He's getting a little big. <laughs> they suck. The evolution of a brand. I have them in a critter box. So CJ made it super simple. Pretty nice. Aloha, my ohana. It is your boy back with another aquatic adventure. Now, if you're new to the channel, let me be the first to give you a nice big warm aloha and welcome. On this channel, we talk about everything aquatics, whether it be freshwater, saltwater, goldfish, koi ponds, local fish store tours, fish rescues, DIY projects, and product reviews in the hobby. So I'm super excited for this video because it has something to do with this aquarium right behind me. I haven't showed you guys this aquarium in a while, but before we do, let's take a trip together, you and I, to Italy. Yeah, Italy. Let's go. Well, watching that little short video and seeing the thumbnail of this video, I'm pretty sure you guys know exactly what's about to go down. Oh yeah, we have the CJ Shark Pro internal canister filter. I've been wanting to show you guys this product for a while. I've been waiting for the right time and the time is now. The reason why the time is now is you don't have to wait. By the time this video comes out and you're watching it, you can probably purchase the Shark Pro. Now, I know a lot of guys have been advertising the Shark Pro, doing videos on the Shark Pro, and then a lot of you guys, especially my Ohana, coming to me asking me, hey, how come I can't pick up this Shark Pro? It's nowhere to be found. And I'm not gonna mention any names out there, Cliff, but, well, when this video actually posts and you're watching it right now, you can probably go online and order one because I just saw CJ's Instagram. By the way, go follow CJ on Instagram. All of their links will be down in the description below. Give them a follow because you would have the sneak peek. I just saw a huge shipment they just got in of all Shark Pros. We're gonna do some pros and some cons. Well, you know what? There really are no cons in the Shark Pro. I think that's why they called it the Shark Pro. It's all pros, there's no cons. We're gonna do a comparison. I got the Shark ADV, and we're gonna compare it to the new Shark Pro. CJ is so smart the way they upgraded this thing. This thing is full of upgrades that you will appreciate, and we're gonna go over the specs, so that way you guys know the difference between the Shark ADV and the new Shark Pro. No cons, all pros. Let's go. This is the Shark Pro 700. They made three different ones, the 900, the 700, and the 500. Obviously, this is the middle one. Let's first start off with that right there. A five-year guarantee. There's three plus two with the online registration, so don't forget to fill out the online registration to get those two extra years. But are you kidding me? CJ, five-year, are you kidding me? Five-year guarantee, guys. You cannot go wrong with just that alone is insane. So the 700 can filter up to 200 liters or 53 US gallons. Take that with a grain of salt. It depends on your bio load, how many fish you have in your aquarium. I would suggest that this filter would be awesome for a 40-gallon breeder that's not overstocked. So just keep that in mind. Now, as far as the gallons it's pushing, you already know CJ is the leader for pushing water. They've only been doing it for like over 40 years. They've started like in the 70s and what are we in 2022 right now so you do the simple math it's been over 40 years and i'm just going to go ahead and say it not just because i'm an ambassador for cj but they are the leaders in pushing water check it out 700 liters per hour and 190 us gallons per hour 
That's insane. This is the 700. So you guys can get an idea. The 900 can actually filter 70 gallons of water. Yeah, so go ahead and put that in the bank, all right? And cash it. These guys push water. They push water like weight. I push mine like weight. This is what it looks like right out of the box. As you can see, it's square shape, which I absolutely love. And I'll explain why I love it. Uh, you got your valve, which is your outflow. I love this. You can actually move it and change it to shoot water to the left, to the right, up and down. And then you have your Venturi system. If you want it, you can. It also has right here at the very top here, a sound or noise reducer. I hear this thing is extremely quiet for the Venturi system if you use it. Of course, we're gonna hook everything up and put it in the aquarium so you guys can see it. Look at this beast. Look at this thing. I love it. Also, comes with your manual. Don't forget about this card, okay? This is the online registration to get those two extra years. So you get that total of a five year guarantee, warranty, guarantee, whatever you wanna call it for the Shark Prizo. I love this piece of marketing that they added. It says Shark Pro, the guarantee of a name, the evolution of a brand. And let me tell you something, the evolution of the Shark Pro is on point let's get into it but before i do gotta give a shout out to team cj you know i had to wear the fresh cj shirt when doing this cj product review so it is a square which i love guess what majority of the aquariums out there are square this thing will fit perfect in a corner you can actually lay it down too flat this way if you wanted to like maybe in a turtle uh, aquarium or maybe you wanted to lay it flat just because you want it hidden behind like some rocks or some plants. So it can either go this way, vertical, or horizontal in your aquarium. You guys ready for a game changer? Right off the bat, here is the ADV, okay? Now, if you wanted to control the flow of the Venturi system, it's up here. You see this thing? Sometimes it's so hard to move, and you know, once it's wet and algae builds up on it, it's slippery. So this dial is really hard to turn. Now. Right off the bat, the upgrade that they made the dial here on the flow, look at, it's a little knob, which makes it so easy. You can just turn it. It's not a dial where you gotta kinda dig your nail and kinda turn it. This makes it so easy to turn. Left, right, an upgrade, game changer. Now the next game changer for the CJ Shark Pro compared to the ADV is the suction. This is the game changer. This is the part I love, absolutely love about the Shark Pro. This suction cup thing sucks to your glass, right? And then you hook this on the little latch and then you can kind of maneuver it back and forth. This piece here, suction cups, suck. I think that's why they're called suction cups because after a while, they give out and they suck. Hence the name suction, <laughs> they suck. This will be on your aquarium, it'll stick and it's great and then after a while it starts to slowly slide down the aquarium because the suction cups tend to lose suction, which sucks. That's the key word with suction cups. Suction, suction sucks, that's what we're gonna say. Now, with the Shark Pro, check it out. No more suction cups. You know what they did? They got smart. It's a magnetic system. So it operates on a magnet system, which I absolutely love. You can hear it, watch. Suction. Magnet, yeah, I prefer the magnet. Well, CJ made it super simple, super easy with this magnetic system, just so you know how it works. It's two separate pieces. This piece comes apart, okay? So this piece, the thinner piece, magnets, right to the base of your Shark Pro. And this is the piece that would sit outside of the aquarium, which it could stick to 12 millimeter thick glass or acrylic. And as it gets closer, be careful of your fingers because boom, they can get smashed. This game changer, never have to worry about suction cups ever again. This magnet reminds me of all of their wave makers. Now, if you guys have a CJ wave maker, ooh wee, you know how powerful that magnet is. So 
Same idea, game changer. I love the magnetic instead of the suction cups. I swear this thing is full of game changers. They should have just called it the Shark Pro Game Changer. Seriously. So we're gonna add the little outflow nozzle which goes right there, really simple. And like I said, you can move this left to right to where you can spin this to where the flow can be to the left. You can make the flow go up, maybe cause some water agitation depending on where you have this Shark Pro at or you can turn it to the left or down, there you go. We're actually gonna add the Venturi system. So it's really easy, it just attaches right there. And this is what it looks like with the Venturi system on. Now this Venturi system is totally optional. If you're not familiar with the Venturi system, this is gonna provide air bubbles, which will supply more oxygen to the water with water agitation. Bubbles will come out of the outtake and you'll see them float up to the top, breaking the surface, which causes more aeration for your fish in the aquarium totally optional. If you're not into it and it's making too much noise, that's why you have this little dial. It's a noise reduction. And I'm curious on how it works. So I'm going to definitely leave it hooked on because we got to check it out, right? Let's check out all the specs on the new Shark Pro. Let's just say we're going to take this nozzle off, okay, which it comes right off. See, it's a little square. It just fits right in there. Super simple. You take it off. There's a reason why we're going to take it off. I don't even know if you guys are ready for this. Are you guys ready? Watch it. Watch it. <gasps> there it is. It's a spray bar, built-in spray bar, which will shoot water out of the holes there, causing water agitation for aeration in your aquarium. Game changer, look at that. It's like a transformer. Okay, all right, that's enough. Anyways, this game changer, spray bar, built-in. Thank you, CJ. Now, to get to the impeller, twist, boop, pull this out, there's your impeller right there. Easy to clean. Maybe get some pump clean by CJ to clean your impeller. Super simple. Look it. It goes in, you turn. Let's go from this angle. Turn, pops off. I'm gonna give you another scenario. Magnet attached to the glass. You wanna service your modules here or your containers, your compartments, where your media is in, biological, mechanical, all that good stuff. Magnet, boom. This part stays attached to the aquarium with the magnet. Don't even touch it, just leave it alone. This, you take out and you service it. Magnet, magnet. I love playing with this stuff. So, I hear something rattling in here. Let's see what type of media comes with the CJ Shark Pro 700. Now the 700 comes with two compartments or modules, whatever you wanna call it. You can probably add another module or compartment with the 700 if you want as well. This thing is so versatile. So let's see what's inside these compartments, all right? In order to separate these two compartments, it's super simple, they just slide apart like that. Pop off, there's a little track, you slide it on, you snap it in, here it is again. Just so you can see it from a different angle, right there, pops off. There's a little track, you slide it on, you close it, you lock it. Real simple. You can see there's two different types of sponges. Let me show you this middle sponge. It's a little bit more porous. I wanna say more of a micro pore sponge. You can see it there. And, and then it is surrounded by two white sponges, more of a macro pore, a little bit bigger pores inside this sponge. That is in the first compartment. Now in the second compartment here, you have some bio media. Let's check it out. Now it's the same thing with this top one here. You just slide the top off and it comes off. Okay, this is the magnet, all right? And inside this compartment, you have bio media, which you can totally get creative with this. So you have the two sponges, which is on the channel side. I call it a channel because as you remove the sponge, it has a channel. I'm gonna tell you guys a little feature about this channel here. So you fit the sponges on the side there. Now in the middle here is super cool because it has a little compartment with bio media, which I think this is the CJ. It sounds like the little beads, look it. Yeah, there are pearls or CJ beads. Really cool. Look how much room you have in there. You can totally customize your own Shark Pro. You don't have to use this media. You can dump this out. You can put seated media in here. I love the fact that they have these compartments now. With the ADV, of course, we take this off. And here's your media compartment. All this media is seated. I can actually dump it into this little compartment if I wanted to. But the thing about this style is it's all free floating in here, right? And then the sponge is at the bottom. You can see it right there. So in order to clean this out, I'd have to dump all this media out. It just makes it a hassle. Here on the Shark Pro, boom, it's got its own little compartment, which I love. And then you can rinse this 
in aquarium water or do what you want to do like i said you can add more containers and you can probably make this into like a media reactor this is what the type of media it is i can see it it'll probably be flowing in here like a media reactor which is awesome it slides in you got it ready to go now remember earlier in the video i was talking about the channels which these sponges sit in see these channels right here each compartment has its own channel i'm just giving you guys a heads up that if this bottom compartment gets stuck with gunk and detritus or whatever it may be this will still work because you have this one that is not stuck or clogged and so on if you have another container and so on if you have another container very good, very smart, CJ. Super simple to put it together. Boom, clicks on. Here is the top piece, magnet, there you go. Magnet here, we stick it to the aquarium, and this beast is ready to go. I love the fact that it's square. It could sit in the corner of an aquarium, kind of be hidden, you know? And it doesn't have the shape of the ADV, which is more of a round circular. This will fit square in a square aquarium. This one, not so much. So you can actually see and compare the two. Shark Pro, ADV Shark. Pretty cool, right? Now let's go ahead and talk about this aquarium that's behind me. This is my South American aquarium. It sits in my living room. I have my twin Oscars, Mary Kate and Ashley. Those are my girls right there. They are Lutino Oscars. We have my beautiful red Oscar right there. Look at him, huh? He's getting a little big. And then we have my Severums. My green Severum is getting big. I haven't showed you guys him in a while. Look at my turquoise Severum kind of cruising. On the bottom, we have my red striped tiger Severum right there in the background. He's doing good. And then we have my Cynodonis catfish that is down there in the plants. That's kind of his little hot spot where he goes. And then I have this beautiful gold Severum. Look how beautiful he's coming in. I think it may be a female. There's some action going on in this aquarium, especially here in the back. There's kind of like a nest and this is where this gold Severum hangs out. Right there, you can see it. There's a nest being built and I'm constantly looking on this rock to see if there's eggs. Nothing yet, but I do see my turquoise Severum right here. I don't know if you guys remember his name at all. Any Anyone? Anyone? That is Robert Van Winkle, better known as Vanilla Ice. He's been hanging out with the gold Severum there in the corner. They've been cleaning this area out, which is super, I mean, not odd, but for this aquarium, it is the behavior. Now, if you guys remember, I had a gold spotted Severum in here and my beautiful red bone, well, I call him red bone, my red spotted Severum. They passed away due to aggression to this guy right here. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, JJ. Look it. Right here. There he is. He's in a timeout. My green Severum got extremely aggressive on them. So now I have him in a critter box. This is kind of a little timeout box. Until I get that 125 out in the Tiki Lounge fish room completed, he's going to go in there along with Tupac. Uh, my Jack Dempsey cichlid. So he's been in this little critter box uh, for about, man, maybe two weeks now. Yep, that's his home because he started to terrorize everybody in here. So as soon as I locked him up, everyone else is doing fine in this aquarium. Enough with the drama. Look there in the corner, the CJ Shark Pro. Let me get out of the glare for crying out loud. Let's go over here to the side. Woo, look at that bad boy with the magnet tucked away in the corner here but look at the flow not only that though that venturi system is kicking out them bubbles get out of the way there it is look at the flow huh look at it that is the venturi system. now let's actually mess with the bubbles if we don't like that flow Let's go ahead and uh, pop the top off here and let's dial this down with the dial. Fish, do not bite my fingers. And as I turn it down, woo, look at that. Let's turn it up. Look at the bubbles, so many bubbles, right? Nice water agitation at the surface there for aeration in the aquarium. And let's turn down the bubbles. Now at full speed, it's pretty quiet guys. I'm gonna be honest. I can't even really hear it. This is what it looks like though. Pretty 
sick. Come over here at this angle. You can see it tucks away in the corner. Pretty nice, right? The focus of this video is the Shark Pro. This is the 700. Like I said, there are three models, 500, 700, and 900. It also has a pretty long cable, it's seven and a half feet. I have the Shark Pro on this end of the aquarium and I'm running the cord behind the aquarium and have it plugged in right down here. Man, your boy is just sweating in this shirt. I just got done moving some furniture. I had to come back here, finish this video off. Ohana, I hope you guys enjoyed this epic product review. CJ Shark Pro, big shout out to CJ. And I'm super honored to be an ambassador for you guys. The proof is in the pudding, all right? The CJ Shark Pro, there's no cons. It's just pro upon pro upon pro. That's why, hence the name Shark Pro. Cop yourself one, guys. I believe it should be out and available to you guys. So go look, search CJ Shark Pro. Highly recommend this internal canister filter. Game changer upon game changer. What can I say? Shout out to the team. Team CJ, love you guys. Stay tuned. Tiki Falls 4.0. We are breaking ground. That's just a little hint for you guys. Much love and aloha. Oh, I know, fake a pay, I want you hooky, you're ill, you money, you're gonna.